Alright guys, this is an example of keyframe looping in 3ds Max. As you can see, it only has three keyframes and I'm looping it. So what I'm going to do is delete the ball and recreate the scene all over again. I'm going to create, a, create the ball again. set the key frame and what we're going to do here is hold shift and drag the key frame to the 20 frame mark so it's identical to the first frame I move to the middle in this scene I just want the ball to bounce so I'm just going to move it up and I'm using the auto key to create the key for that Alright, and we're going to go to the curve editor to loop. I'm going to expand this and select all positions X, Y, and Z. Click the out of range and then select type and loop. Close that out and press play and it's looping. And that's how you create a bouncing ball or keyframe looping in 3ds Max.